Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Cafe Comedy Tour with this microphone stand and Sanjay Monagdala. There are two things men can't say with a straight face. Hey, I just came back from Thailand. And hey, I just flew Kingfisher Airlines. <laughs> you guys know what I'm talking about, right? Now all the men are smiling here, right? Our seven-year-old has no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> but it's like, I mean, that's the thing, right? Look, it's hard to take the airline seriously when they have a show called Search for the Next Kingfisher Calendar Girl. Because you will never have any other airline do that. You'll never have Search for the Next Air India Calendar Girl. <laughs> Right, and Kingfisher, they're like, chai, coffee, chai, coffee. <laughs> Air India, they're like, chai, coffee, uh, chai, coffee, <laughs> chai, coffee. <laughs> it wouldn't go down well, guys. It would not go down. I've noticed, all right, quite a few things. Another TV show I started watching, MasterChef Australia. Have you seen it, all right? We're here at Coffee Day, a lot of nice food that's being cooked, okay? I was watching the show. They make food sound very exciting. Have you, have you seen the show, Ashwin, right? Have you seen it, yeah? You're big fans of the show, right? They, they turn you on with food. They're like, all right, what you got cooking over there? What is that? Ooh, it's a nice pork belly, is it? It's nice and firm, nice and tender, that pork belly. Why don't you make it, make sure it's nice and hot, give it a little slap. I'm like, what is this guy watching, okay? And they actually had an Indian guy on the show, Kumar, okay? Or as they called him, Kumar, right? And they're like, like it, they were having fun with this guy. They're like, Kumar, what you got cooking over there? That's a nice cheesecake, is it? What are you going to add to that cheesecake, Kumar? Chili, okay? Uh, Kumar, that's a cheesecake. What else are you going to add to that cheesecake? Masala! Um, listen, Kumar. This is MasterChef Australia, not MasterChef Andhra, all right? Why don't you go back to Sri Lanka, where you belong, all right? It's not going to happen. Uh, what do you guys do for work? Uh, this is not that hard. Okay. What do you all do? You're silent. Okay, this is what you say to your girlfriend, all right? It's like, baby, say you love me. I'm silent. <laughs> No. <laughs> Baby, say my name. No. <laughs> so, no, no, but listen, like, I'm a, I have a friend right now who's getting an arranged marriage, but it's 2011. Arranged marriages are quite different, okay? I was like, hey, dude, how's it going with the arranged marriage? Like, how's the planning? He's like, dude, really good. I'm really close to finalizing the girl. And I was like, dude, are you buying a car? <laughs> and that's when I realized in 2011... Looking for a wife is a lot like shopping for a car, okay? It really is, okay? Like, no, think about it. If Shali.com had a nice showroom on 100 feet road, okay, where you could, like, come in and look at the products, all right? Huh? They do have a showroom on 100 feet road. Barth Matrimony has, and they have the products just laid out, okay? <laughs> wow. No, I mean, I'm curious to go, right? I'm sure you'll walk in, they'll be like, Thank you for coming to barthmatrimony.com. <laughs> big offer, big sale on all the engineers right here. Okay? They're all on sale. Okay? Man, that, I think it would happen, right? And then, of course, I would walk in with my mom. Because let's be honest, she makes the choice, right? <laughs> I'm looking at all the products. I'm like, mommy, this one. I really like this one, mommy. She's like, beta, too much boot space. No. <laughs> you can't have that. <laughs> like, mommy. How about this one? Look, made in Chandigarh. Beta, high maintenance. We don't want. Uh, okay, mommy, this one. Look, made in America. Ooh, fancy. Beta, too many previous owners. No, you can't take that. <laughs> um, now, uh, did you drive here by any chance? You did? What kind of car do you drive? Huh? Skoda. Okay. So I just got a brand new car. Uh, I don't want to brag. A really expensive, top of the line Tata Nano. Okay. Ladies, please hold your breath. All right. I mean, stop. Don't rush the stage. I can only fit two of you in it, or uh, one if you're Punjabi. Okay. Like, 
relax. It's uh, no offense to any Punjabi people here. I'm just, I I'm Punjabi as well. I can do that show. All right, I can do that. No, but I just got this car, and I've realized in India, Tata makes everything in this country. You can sustain your life on Tata, can't you? Like, you could go to work in your Tata Nano. You're working at Tata Consulting Services, all right? Using the internet on your Tata Photon, trying to call your wife on your Tata Docomo. She's upset because you've got a Tata Nano. She's hanging out with the guy from Tata Steel, <laughs> all right? She says she's a Tata Star Bazaar, but we know she's full of shit, all right? They make everything. I'm, like, really scared. Pretty soon, I'm going to have a baby. He's going to come out, Rohan, a Tata Enterprise, you know? I'm just going to say that. And ladies, those of you who don't want a baby, they have a morning after pill. It's just called Tata. <laughs> Like I've been watching uh, a lot of Bollywood movies since I've been here. You watch Bollywood, Mr. MBA? Yeah? And do you think the movies make sense or no? Some do, right? Like whenever I watch some of these Bollywood movies, I think they're telling the young men the wrong way to meet a woman. Right? I was watching this like very old Bollywood movie, like Ram Lakhan, right? Anil Kapoor just like comes out and he sees a girl off in the distance. He sees her across the street and he just looks at her. Does he say hi, hello, how are you, my name is like Ram or Lakhan or whatever? He doesn't, right? He just looks at her and he's like... <laughs> A.G. O.G. A.G. O.G. Don't you think I'm creepy? <laughs> and I'm sitting there <laughs> watching this movie like, that's not how you meet a girl, Anil Kapoor. Like, like, how is that? Has any girl ever met a man like that, right? Ladies in the back, right? Have you ever like, asked your friend, hey, how did you meet your fiancé? Well, it was two in the morning. Uh, I was trying to take an auto home. <laughs> Him and 300 of his friends saw me and they followed me. And they started dancing. And I knew he was the one for me. Dil to pagal hai. What can I say? That's not right. And like there's another movie where also the girls act also very strange. Rangila. You've seen it, right? He's laughing how I pronounced it, I think. But it's another movie, right? Where she has that short miniskirt on. Boys in the back. You've seen Rangila? Right? Yeah, he's like, mmm, yeah, I've seen it. I'm watching it on my phone, not listening to you, yeah. Um, Rangila, you've seen it, right, miss? Right? So she has that short, short mini skirt on. And she is just walking down the street at night in a mini skirt going, tanaha, tanaha, tanaha. <laughs> my Hindi is horrible, I know, like, some of these guys have laughed for the wrong reason. But apparently, tanaha means I'm alone, I'm so lonely, something of that sort. So once again, Girls, I'm sorry, but if you were outside a coffee day right now, right, on a hundred feet road, at night, in a miniskirt, saying, I'm lonely, I'm lonely, you would not be. <laughs> All right? You'd have about 300 auto drivers and me behind you. Going, AG, OG, come back. <laughs>